Hey guys, what is up? It's me, Kajira17. And as you can see here, I have an unboxing from Keep Ste Speed Keeping Store from Naperville, Illinois. So, what we're going to do is we're going to get this uh, unboxed with my trusty black knife. And here, and this tells you what I wanted. Okay. Now, here's where the actual cube is. Nothing in there. Just gonna just throw that to the side. Oh, now we have a boxing with a cube for you cube. Uh, first time I've ever ordered a cube for you cube, and first time I've ever ordered from Cube Speed Cubing Store. They come out of Naperville, Illinois, and I live in uh. Uh, Aurora, Illinois, kind of like on the brink of Aurora, Illinois, and I get the cube, I ordered it like Sunday night, and I got it, um, today, which is Tuesday, I got it Tuesday morning, so, it's very fast, I got it in the two days, so, let's open this, it's really warm, that's kind of weird, huh, and you can see here, I got the cube for you fully functional, 3 by 3 by 5 it all automatically, when I'm doing my first turns, it already, uh, already, already feels really good. Um, there's not really, oh, well, yeah, it's kind of rough. I don't really think you can do, uh, finger tricks very fast on it. It seems like it would pop very easily because of these small pieces right here. It's not like, not everything's proportional. Well, I don't really know if I can call it proportional. Oh, wow, they, the pieces pop out very easily. Already feels lubed, too. Maybe it's already lubed. Uh, so here are the pieces. Just two put together. They're about, maybe about as big. Yeah, it really feels lubed. It's very, like, I don't know why I want to say slimy. Um, so that side, I'll take, about, take out this. Here are the corners put together. Well, not put together, you can take them apart from each other. As you can see, we have a red core. And what it looks like to me is just a standard 3x3 core. Nothing really major, just uh, it's red and then we have black extensions. So, uh, nothing really major. Uh, it just Yeah, like I just said, it looks like a standard 3x3 core. Okay, now the pieces are very easy to put back in. And uh, let's just see if it corner cuts. Um, it's gonna, hopefully nothing breaks. Just do the top layer. So far, so good. We'll do right where the black is. Alright, it looks like that's as far as it goes with the first layer. Just about right here. Just right just right before the black. Just right before the plastic. Now let's try the second and the first layer. Okay. Try the black line. Aha! Uh, -huh. uh, just at the where the plastic is, that's as far as the core cuts on there. Um... I think mean, that would be the same for the rest, but this is, this, I don't really think you'd move all three layers at once. Maybe you would, I don't know. I'm going to do reverse quarter cutting. Um, uh, let's see here. Oh, whoa, there's already a tear in the sticker. Huh. I guess that, I, that probably won't really matter. Uh, that does not corner, reverse corner cut at all so far, the first layer. Yeah, it does not corner, reverse corner cut at all. So, uh, corner cutting is pretty good. That's pretty. I don't really know um, if that's like expected with this, but um, corner cutting is good. Reverse, not at all. Does not reverse at all. Um, oh, um, a little, a little. Um, I guess stiff with that algorithm. Well, not really algorithm. It's just really a trick. Uh, yeah. Let's see here. Let's see if we can do the. Checker board on it. Oops. These these two layers are really stick, stuck to each other. These are much more. Oh goodness, crap. Oh, there we go. Uh, these are much more stiff. Oh no, let's do it this way. And that's really that's the checkerboard pattern on this. That's pretty cool. Let's look at the. Yeah, there we go. That's a pretty cool pattern. Um. So nothing really special about this cube so far. It seems really good. I'm, I always got really excited about it when uh, I ordered it. And I, I didn't order from Cube Depot because Speed Cubing Store, it was a dollar cheaper. And actually, no, with shipping, it was a dollar eighty cheaper than a Cube Depot. And uh, that's why I bought it. And it came faster because uh, I live in Illinois also. 
in just a town away. So uh, I'm going to uh, mix this up right now. See what it looks like all mixed up. Wow. Oh wow. This cube is gonna be very interesting to solve, I have to say. Let's get one. It's normal. Come on. There we go, and there now we gotta get something right here. I wanna scramble it. Like a normal cube, but I can't because it's bandaged. So I think this is how it looks all scrambled up. It's still really warm, probably because it was in my mailbox and it's like 90 degrees out. Alright, well I'm going to take a stab at solving this. I'll get back to you guys in about uh, a week, yeah. Alright guys, I'm back with an update for the cube for you, uh, 3x3x5. Three by three by and uh, I did lube it with Lubix uh, using my special way that I don't really know. I haven't really seen on YouTube anybody who's used it before, but I did not lube like the internals because I didn't want to take it apart I just uh, took off uh, parts like full sides but uh, anyway let's get to the actual cube itself um, I've solved this maybe about a total of tw uh, 10 to 20 times actually no, closer to 15 to 20 times and I'm at the point well almost at the point where I can just solve this and have no mistakes whatsoever um, it does move very smooth I didn't actually test corner cutting uh, yeah, I'm just, I've already done three solves since I've lubed it today. So, uh, see if corner cutting is any different. Good. Let's go to where it corner cut before well, the first day I got it. Oh, it almost popped. Alright, so corner cutting right here is its limit. And then two layers. Oh, corner cut's right there. Ah, oh, corner cut's right there, too. So that's about its limit, too. So that's about it. I'm not going to corner cut three layers because that's just, I don't know. Well, yeah, like that. Uh, that was like my second pop, I think, with this cube. Uh, I popped it yesterday. I was just solving it, and it all of a sudden just popped. So, other than that, I, haven't really, I don't really have any complaints about this cube. I mean, it's very good. Uh, I highly recommend it actually. I don't really know of any other 3x3x5s. Three by three by I know of a 3x3x5 three three mod, but um, nothing like this that is a different brand. Uh, I think it's really good. I'm actually very surprised. I've heard that q for u is really bad, and then I've heard from some people that q for u is, is decent. So uh, I was kind of just uh, throwing myself under the bus there to see if this was going to be a good cube or not. If it really wasn't, that would have been a kind of a waste of 16 bucks on this. But I'm very impressed with this cube. Uh, like I said earlier, I think in the video, I lubed it with Lubix, so, um, it's very good actually, I'm very surprised with, uh, how well it performs, um, going fast, and, uh, just yesterday, I was solving it, and in the middle of a turn, just like this, this whole chunk just burst out, and I was very surprised with that, because I hadn't had this cube pop, and I haven't heard of any poppings with it either, so I was just kind of skeptical about that. But I did not adjust any tensions at all. Tensions are still the same because I like it like that. It's kind of loose. It's like maybe about medium, maybe a little tighter than medium. Uh, nothing really that major. I think these are just stock tensions for everything. But uh, I do, like I've said before, I highly recommend this cube. Uh, get it. And I'll be making a tutorial on how to solve it. And I'll be doing coming out with a solved video. And I will be coming out with uh, my way how I lube my cubes when I don't get them in a DIY kit. I'll show you guys how I do that. And so for the next three, in the next couple days, that's what it'll be like because I'll be going on vacation uh, next week on next Saturday. Not this upcoming one, but the next Saturday. So I'll be uh, producing three videos probably in a one week. So look forward to that. And then also I'll be doing uh, vlogs on vacation, uh, a daily vlog. I'll, pro I'll definitely hope to upload every day. So look forward to those. So uh, there might be some cubing things, but mostly just my vacation. And this is like pretty much it for this review, I should say. Uh, I'm Connor, and I'll see you guys this week. Yeah.